Hey, what's up, YouTube? Um, I wanted to sit down and talk with you for a minute about some things that I realized was happening um, that was causing a cause and effect, but on the negative side. First, I don't have an issue with do-it-yourselfers. I think you know, you know, if you can pick up and learn how to do whatever it is on your own, you have that ability. You know, that's wonderful. But my thing is, you just cannot use everything. I find that a number of do not, I mean, do it yourself first. Go to the beauty supplies and the stores, and they have every product known to man. And you are using a good number of these products. That is not good for your hair. That's not good for you. That's not good for your regimen. And think about how often you're shampooing. Think about um, if you're doing these things on a daily basis on top of sweat, on top of the oils your scalp naturally secrete. That's a lot to be putting into your hair. That is a lot, a lot. I'm sure if you do that, which you see me do in other videos, where you take the lock and wring it out like a wet towel, you would have a massive amount of oils and different other things that have impacted themselves in there. That is not good for the longevity of your hair. Not on any level. I'm not trying to tell you to change anything that you're doing, nor am I trying to change your whole life will tell you that you're wrong. Not where I'm going. Only thing I'm saying is find a product that works for your hair type. Find a system, as I've shown you, that works for what you're trying to achieve, what you're trying to conquer, or what you're trying to do. Excuse me, what you're trying to do. Use those products for your greater good, not just because somebody else said, do this and do this my way. That's not hairstyling because everyone does not have the exact same hair texture or hair type. That's why you have so many different products and you have different opportunities to go pick up something and say, well, maybe this will try for this part of my hair and maybe this will try for this part. That's why I use the word balance. You have to put different things together to make them work because there isn't that perfect product out there. Nowhere on levels of reality. So another thing I want to talk about is after with all of the doing it yourself and adding all of the products, all of the oils, doing all of the pulling, trying all the styles, doing all the nip tucking, doing all of that little stuff so your eyesight savvy, you have a lot of repairs that you need it. And I have a lot of clients that come to me. Yes, you have some stylists that, you know, just go smash in your head and do some crap, or whatever. We've covered that. But when you are doing these things, like just getting up and going, pull it up in a ponytail and losing all of this size. Or just doing the outside of edge and the inside, you, you just leave it alone because you know your arms were tired and so your inside is all mad together. These things do not work for your hair because I'm sure when you started growing or with whatever you thought about achieving, this was not your outcome. So you have to be a little more knowledgeable to what's going on versus just putting something in there or just doing it on that level. That's not going to work for you. So what I think you should do is again, just pay attention to, excuse me, pay attention to the products. Pay attention to what they do. Pay attention to how they're going to do it. Pay attention to what they're going to bring to you. Pay attention to what the product is made out of because I guarantee you, just like medicine, everything has a side effect. So, yes, it smells good, but it's made out of wax, so that wax is going to hold in there. That smell is not going to stay, but that wax is. So, yes, it looks good, the bottle is pretty, but you put it in your hair, and it's something that has different granules in it that can cut your hair. And just because something is in the liquid form does not think that it, that could happen. It could happen. A lot of these products do not tell you the real deal, and I don't think a lot of people will on those aspects. That's why I do believe in a good, healthy trial and error. I do believe in understanding what your hair is doing and what you're working with. Understand what a dreadlock is. Understand what your hair is going through. Understand what you're making your hair do. Understand what you need to do. It, it, it goes a whole list of that. And that goes from even if you're relaxing to just natural afro to dreadlocks to braids. All of these things have a cause and effect, so you need to find the balance in that to make these things work for you. Because if you won't, then you will be unvoluntarily rocking the fade. Nothing I can do or nothing I can say about that. Last thing. 
Now, I don't want to put this person on blast and make it seem like I'm talking on a negative aspect. But I had a video where a young man told me he shampooed, young man or young woman, I don't remember. They shampoo every three months. That's deep. And the reason I find that deep and the reason why it kind of baffles me and bothers me, because, one second. Because, excuse me, that means no stylist, no one out there has tried to educate this individual to what's necessary. Not even my way, their way, somebody else's way. No, what's necessary, a good shampoo, good conditioning, understanding what your hair is going to do, understanding where your hair is going to go. Um, I can't tell you enough that even if you shampoo once a week and you just got to get and become a best friend with somebody that you know can twist the hell out of some hair, hey, make it work. Be proactive. Do what you have to do because I don't know what everybody's pocket is like and I don't know what everybody's finances is like. But find something or someone out here that can educate you to what's really necessary. And from that, I'm going to take you to a regimen that I tell my clients to use that I know it's not going to break the bank, that I know it's not going to break their hair, that I know it's not going to help have them upside down or are doing some things at home that I know that they don't want, want to do, two can't do, or three not even willing to do. My clients come every three to four weeks. That's once a month when you think about it. So I charge one fee for everything because I know that those things are highly necessary. Deep cleansing shampoo because I have not seen you in three weeks and I know a good number of them have not shampooed. So a good deep cleansing shampoo and I offer t excuse me, two of those. A highly moisturizing shampoo because we need to start implementing some moisturization back. Being that I just robbed you of everything. But I needed to do that because I needed to take three weeks of filth out of your head. That's just the way our bodies work. It works to cleanse itself out and get those things out. So let's get them out of your hair. That's what the hair is for. is to catch and protect you and protect your body and your scalp from all of those things. So these um, chemicals and different things that are put together are the ones I use are safely based products to get these things to work and get them clean where they need to be without brittleness, breakage, harsh coloring, anything. So after that, I do the highly moisturizing shampoo, then you get a conditioner. This is every three weeks. I'll let you go four. After four, I'm going to have to hit you up and say what's going on. If you got to come in, just come in. I really don't care. I just don't want baldness. I don't understand baldness. Not when there's ample amount of products and there's stores and there's everything. I don't get it. We go to school for this. This is education. This is life. So let's get it. Again, after those, that whole system, then I showed you what I make up, what I use, what's all in that. And everything in that is to build healthiness. It's for longevity. It's for versatility. It's so you can have a head full of hair, not a suit of armor. This gel back stuff, then you can't shampoo for... Six months. Since when? Since since when? I haven't had that issue. Now with a client, and you've seen ample amount of the clients that I've started. Again, I'm not saying do it my way. I'm just saying use since. I, I want to educate you because I see that there aren't many people out there educating and giving anything back and showing that this systems that we're using are just to get by. I don't want to get by and I don't want you to be the victim of getting by on because every time you see a get by from celebrity on down, I don't care, everybody got the get by effect, baldness. That's not what's up. That's not what we're trying to achieve and I don't want to be one of those stylists trying to figure out how to pinpoint a lock that's this long on a strand this short. I saw some dreadlock extension videos and, and pictures that threw me. But that's what you people want sometimes. I can't stop you. I, I'm not tripping. After that, after my spray solution, I put you under the dryer. All of those things are going to be baked in. You're going to have essential oils, which you need, so you won't have to oil every day. You're going to have uh, vitamins and proteins, so we can build up that hair to be strong while it grows. 
you're going to have stimulation so that hair can grow. I guarantee you it will grow. Keep that scalp clean so that you won't have the itching and the irritation and the scalp won't be driving you nuts. You have little sponges all over your head that are going to absorb every little thing that goes on. So you want to be knowledgeable of that. Use the right things. Put the right system on here. Get the right balance going. You'll have grow. You would have the length and the dreadlocks. You would have that journey that you desire. You would have that great spirit because you will feel great about your hair. You'll be able to style it and have the evolution of life as we've learned how to do different styles to, to execute a different look. So we have a different illusion. We have a different feeling. You, did, you really don't understand how styling has brought about a great thing in, in my industry. People come in, they lock you. Even look at the before and after videos. You have locks that just straight, the people sitting looking like this. You style and give it something else. They may not be smiling, but they give a little more because they, at that point, feel like, okay, I look different and I like the way I look. Even every woman walks out of the salon catching every mirror she can find and tell me I'm lying. So, now, back to reality, back to realness, back to what's necessary. Don't do it for me. Do it for you. Give yourself what you need. Offer yourself the, the great products and everything that's necessary. Even if you have to find avenues to get them, let's get them. Let's do it. Um, I'm branching out to Atlanta at this point. AtlantaDreadlocks.com is up and it's working. I will, I'm looking to be on Peach Street and I'm, what I've heard was Buckhead. Uh, it's downtown, centrally located. So. Let me let me know what's going on. I will be there very soon. Start business again. You can check out Atlanta Dreadlocks. Uh, I don't have the address right offhand, but I'm moving around to teach my people to offer you greatness. So give me up for more. Check me out for more videos. Peace.